Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity. And we're here today to show you why the brain and nerves of the human body are crossed over. And to simulate the brain, we have these two loops and it simulates each half of the brain, one half here, the other half here. And the lower two loops simulate the nervous system, so one half here and one half here. And right now, they're actually connected straight through by these copper links right here. And you can see that we've got the meter, it's reading AC voltage, and we have the probes in the top set of loops, which are our brain. And the links go straight through right now. So this loop is connected to this loop, and this one is connected to this one and there is no connection between each half right now. And you can see that right now we're reading 0 0.209 AC volts. And that's coming from this AC cable that we have hanging down at the back. So our AC cable is actually radiating AC voltage into these loops and we're reading it off our meter. So let's get a stable reading. So right now we're reading 0 0.210 AC volts. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull out the straight loops right here. So this is what we had in on each side. And I'm going to insert some crossed loops. So these are the crossed connections. As you can see, they're very different. So let's put the first connection in. It's a little bit tricky to get in. Okay, that's the first one. And here is the second one. Okay, we're in. So both loops are now crossed. So this one right here is connected to this one and this one right here is connected to this one. So we now have an arrangement that is just like the human brain and the human nervous system and that cross occurs at the base of the brain and as you can see our AC voltage has gone to almost zero. It's 0 0.017 so it's very very different. And that's the reason why you have a cross that takes place between the brain and the human nervous system. It's purely there as an electrical noise reduction technique. And that's exactly what nature has perfected because we all walk around in energy fields. And without that cross between the brain and the nervous system, we would not be able to walk around in these energy fields. It's very, very important that the brain and the nervous system is balanced and cancels out in these fields that we walk around in. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.